The results of a six-year study by the Dark Energy Survey have shed important new light on two of the greatest mysteries in astronomy, the nature of dark energy and dark matter. The survey is a collaboration of more than 400 scientists from 25 institutions in seven countries. From observations of 226 million galaxies covering one-eighth of the sky, the most detailed map of the current large-scale structure of the universe has been built up, along with a movie showing how that structure has evolved over the past 7 billion years. Remarkably ordinary matter, the kind that we see in the form of ourselves, planets, stars and galaxies, makes up only about 5% of the total mass energy in the universe. The rest of the cosmic contents are invisible and of an as yet unknown nature. Dark matter, which binds galaxies together, accounts for a further 25% of the universe and the rest, 70%, is dark energy, the phenomenon that causes the expansion of the universe to accelerate. The latest results tell us more about the effects these two powerful components have had in shaping the cosmic web, the cobweb-like bright strands where galaxies lie and the great voids that exist between them. Observations were made using the 570 megapixel dark energy camera on the 4 meter telescope at the Cerro Tololo Observatory in Chile, one of the most powerful digital cameras in the world. They've revealed in unprecedented detail how dark matter is distributed across billions of light years of space. The survey team have published a colored map, the brightest areas of which show the densest areas of dark matter. These correspond to superclusters of galaxies, while black regions are cosmic voids. To test our current understanding of the universe, survey scientists compared their results with those obtained by the Planck Space Observatory, which measured the distribution of microwave radiation from a time just 400,000 years after the Big Bang. The model that cosmologists have built up predicts how dark matter should have evolved from that early era 13 billion years ago to the present. There had been hints from earlier work by the Dark Energy Survey team and other galaxy surveys that dark matter in the present day universe is a bit less clumpy than expected based on the standard cosmological model. If that disagreement were to persist, it might suggest a problem with the way the measurements were made. Alternatively, it could point to a flaw in our understanding of the way gravity works, in particular, a breakdown of Einstein's general theory of relativity. While the latest results are in broad agreement with standard cosmology, they leave open the possibility that dark matter is spread just a little smoother than we might expect. Interesting times lie ahead, as scientists work further to unpack and analyze the immense amount of data that the Dark Energy Survey has gathered.